What is up everyone, it is me Sivo. In today's video, I'm going to be telling you how to use the APIs with Discord.py. In this video, I'm going to be using two links. I'm going to be using uh, an image API, which gets a random picture of a dog. And I'm also going to be using a would you rather, so it sends a text message. With the image one, you can also use GIFs with it. So if it's a GIF API you're using, you would be able to use this, how you program the image one. Also, I'm going to link down another link where it shows you a bunch of other APIs. It's got like 30 on there and then it's got a bunch in the comments as well. People just advertising theirs. So, yeah. So, anyways, let's get into the video. So, first, we're just going to do at bot dot command. And then we're just going to um, do async there. And then with async there, we're going to do dog. We're going to put CTX as we're going to be getting a dog image. And then uh, we're going to um, do R, which is basically short for response, I think. And then we're going to do request. If you ain't got request, it should be already installed, but just do pip install requests. And then once you have got that, you're just going to do dot get. So basically, I'll show you what dot get does in a bit. So if we paste the link in here, if we go into our uh, browser and we type in this link, as you see here, it's going to have message HTTP and it's got status here, but you don't have to worry about this. And every time you refresh, the link is random so what we're going to be doing is getting the, the message uh this message thing here so how we get this is we're going to do rest which is also short for response uh and we're going to do r.json so basically we're putting this we're getting the json into this as this is as the link is in a json format so we're going to be getting the json so now we have got that we're going to put it into an embed so it looks all nice so we'll just do em equals discord dot embed and then we're just going to do uh, em and then we're going to set an image so set image and then we're going to do url and then if you don't know how you uh the work with like json files i recommend learning on it so you can understand this better but basically we're going to get the json and then we're going to do brackets and then comma or oh, comma is that comma or quote it oh, i don't know and then we're just going to get the message so basically when you use uh, the brackets and then you put commas surrounded by the name of the keyword it will get that a certain um what's next to the keyword what's assigned to it basically and then we're just going to do await ctx dot send and then we're just going to send it so we'll just do embed equals m and then that is literally all you have to do it's very simple so now if we play the bot and we quickly test this out so we go into our discord and we uh type in dog like this it's going to give a picture of a dog and it's just going to be random every time. It's just going to send a bunch of little dogs and it will keep sending cool little dogs. So now let's do a would you rather one, which is with text uh, bot dot command. And then we're going to do async def, and then we're just going to do would you rather. And then we're going to do CTX. And then what we're going to do is get the link real quick as we don't have to worry about that. So if we get the link and we just do same thing, r equals requests dot get. And then we put the link inside here and then we're just going to do data we're going to just call it i mean you can call it res but i'm just going to yeah let's just call it res equals um r.json and then we're just going to do await ctx.send and then we're going to send the the res and then we're going to get the um we're going to get the question so if we just put question in like that and we run the bot uh we can also and then we go into our bot again and then we just do would you rather it's gonna just give us oh we got a keyword error did i spell it wrong okay guys so i, so I found out the api just wasn't working for some reason but this one does so um i use the truth one so just type this in i'll leave it down in the description and if we play the bot and we go into discord and we write truth um it will say if you ever wrote a memoir what would the title be so there will be apis but sometimes don't work anymore but you guys enjoyed drop a like and subscribe this is how you do apis as you see here we keep writing true it just keep being random and yeah so you can put these in slash commands if you want a video on how to do apis with slash commands drop a like and bye